Hello, welcome back to uh, my channel. In this video, I'm going to be showing you all my Season 1 Ninjago sets. So, like, Rise of the Serpentine, or Rise of the Snakes, whatever it is. Uh, this will not count Legacy, because it is technically Season 1, but it didn't come out in 2012. I have quite a few sets, and um, yeah, I'll just show you all of them, and... Yeah, talk about them. So the first set is this Ninjago Rattlecopter. Uh, I'll go over all the villain vehicles first and then I'll go on to the ninjas. So this is the Rattlecopter. Um, I'll go over the minifigures at the end of the video, but right here is the set, you know, it's pretty cool. It might be incomplete because when I bought it, it was missing some parts, so I had to like part out my fang par truck to complete this. Uh, here's the cockpit. You know, not, not much crazy going on in there, but they do have um, some stickers. Or, yeah, it's a sticker, I'm pretty sure. Anyways, um, there's uh, these, like, missile things. These open up, and they can drop, like, snakes, I'm pretty sure. At the back, they um, use a spinner crown. Um, up here are some flick fire missiles. These can move. Uh, that piece is pretty dirty. Should probably fix that. So yeah, you know, it's it's a good set. Um, I like. It's probably one of my favorite. I like the um, racket ball set, but I don't have that. Um, I'll put a photo on screen. But, you know, that set, it's pretty cool, but this one's my favorite that I own. The next one is this Fang Pyro truck. Um, this is my good one, and it's complete. I have two. Um, pretty cool flex, but yeah, this one's my one that's complete. Uh, it's pretty cool because the tail spins. It's kind of hard to do because my uh, backdrop is, like, in the way. Uh, the tail spins using that knob. Here's the interior. It's pretty empty. Um, I don't even think it can fit the snake general. I don't know, you might be able to because it's open at the back. I don't think I've tried. The uh, rims on this are used with spinner crowns. Same on this side, obviously. This jaw, like, opens. And they use a flag as the tongue. Uh, and here are some, like, storage. You can put stuff in there. Same on the other side. Right there. Nothing in there. I probably, like, took it out or lost it. This set I bought used. It came with all the minifigures. Um, and the other one, I have another one. I'll show, uh, right after this. So yeah, this one's complete. And my other one is incomplete. I'll show it to you right now. This one is the incomplete one, obviously. You can see the windshield's missing. The back part of the tail is missing. It's even missing a spinner crown. Um, I bought this set in a haul. I made a video on it. It, it was um, kind of missing some pieces, and I already have this set complete, so I just took the windshield off and put on the rattlecopter. I like that set more. This side, you know, like like that part, I could probably find it, put it there. It's just I'm too lazy to, and I don't care that much. Uh, I'm surprised that it's like decent. It's only missing like maybe, I mean, a couple pieces. So I parted out some of these parts to complete my other fang powered truck, and I took the windshield for the rattle copter. And this tail and this blue, like the two blue flame pieces, I put on Lasha's blade cycle, which I have. Um, yeah, this one's missing some parts. Maybe someday I'll complete it or I'll buy another. I don't know. But uh, the parts are on Lasha's blade cycle, and I'll show that to you right now. Here's Lasha's blade cycle. As you can see, that's the part that I took off to put on here. 
and the blue flames at the back. I think this set actually doesn't look bad. I don't know. It's a bit, it's a bit whatever, honestly. But it's better than that snake mech or whatever. I'll put a photo on screen. Yeah, I think this set's better. Here's the front. I'm, I might be missing like one or two pieces. I'm not sure. There's no jaw or anything, but it's whatever. I don't know. I don't have any problems with it. This tail like sort of adjusts. It's using, um, I don't know what these pieces are called, but they're like, they have like friction. So they like don't really like move. Um, yeah, it's a good set. I don't really have any complaints to it. Um, I think that might be all my villain vehicles. There are my, uh, serpentine vehicles laying on the floor. I found this. <laughs> it's Junior's, so not Season 1, even though it is. But, uh, whoops. But yeah, so that shelf's complete, and now I'll show you the Ninja's vehicles for, uh, Season 1. So here's Jay's Electro Jet, I'm pretty sure it's called. I have two of these sets also. Um, this one's complete, and I'll show it. I'm not gonna bother showing the other one because there's really no point. With the Serpentine vehicles, you can army build them like in the show, but as this is the Ninja's vehicle, there's not really duplicates of it in the show, so I'm not gonna bother. And I have this as the Legacy set, and I'm also not gonna show it because it's Legacy and not technically 2012 season one. Sorry for my finger. Um, it's it's good. It's show accurate and I like that. Um, Legacy one is arguably better looking, but I don't know. I like this one. Here's the interior. Oh, it's decent. I mean, I don't know why it's white. I don't even know if that's how it's supposed to be. There's a play feature. I, uh, I don't even know how that works, honestly. I think, do I have to, like, clip these out first? I don't know. Someone tell me. The struggle is real. Hold on. Yeah, I don't know if this is how it works, but... Okay. It's probably broken. I don't know. Like, sometimes the band just doesn't work, but whatever. There, that's how it should look. Fully open. I don't really like it like this. It looks too narrow down there and um i don't know like that it's red and on this side it's green and green and red like do we need that i don't think so but whatever here is zan's um snowmobile is that what it's called i don't know uh this came in the fang pyre truck i have another one of this also i know pretty cool flex but uh i'm not gonna show it off because there's really no point uh, it's good, you know, stickers here. Oh, my bad, why'd it get so dim? Anyways, sorry about that. <laughs> um, I like the uh, ice pieces, they're pretty cool. They're like a nice mold. Um, I'm pretty sure that's missing the handle there. It rolls, somehow. Not really good on this backdrop, but uh, it does roll. I don't know. It's pretty small. I mean, in the show it was also small. The building techniques are decent. Really can't complain. I mean, I think it's one of the weaker ones of the uh, vehicles. But, I don't know. It's not terrible. But it's like, not as good as some of the others. Now, speaking of weak, this set is missing quite a few pieces. So, I apologize. I bought this in a haul, and it wasn't my intentions for it to be missing pieces. At some point, if I can ever get this set for cheaper, I would buy it or just rebuild, like, the parts that are missing. I don't even... it doesn't work, but, you know, if you, like, cover it, it looks decent. From what I remember how the set should be, it's pretty good. I mean, mine's obviously incomplete. And I, again, I apologize for that. Um, I would try to rebuild it, but I'm busy, is my excuse. Sorry if you hear background noise, my window's open. Uh, but yeah, this set, it's, it's good, but mine's bad because it's missing parts.
So here's more of them on the floor. Um, over here is my spare Zane's uh, snowmobile. I have two. And over here is my other elect electro jet. Sorry that it doesn't zoom in that well. But yeah, it's like missing the uh, back part. It's missing a lot of parts. So I just didn't bother including it. Now this set is definitely my favorite one out of all of them. I don't have all the season one sets, but for the ones that I do own, this one is definitely my favorite. Uh, it's a good, damn, how do I even move it? Um, it's a good build. I didn't build it, but it looks good. Like the, um, the look of it looks really nice. It's missing this one, I have it. I'm just missing that clip that goes on to it. So, sorry about that. But yeah, it, it looks good. It's pretty show accurate, which I'm genuinely impressed by. Um, the minifigures on this were really good. Got all the ZX suits, um, Spitta, and Pythor. Uh, these wheels are pretty big, obviously. This part detaches. I'm gonna see if I can figure out how to do that. So I figured out how to get those out. You just push the knob on the back, um, that right there, you push it in, and it pops out. It's kind of hard to do with one hand, but if I pull it, there. That's pretty cool. And now I'll detach it. So this part, the top part detached, looks pretty good. I like that it also did that in the show. You can still access this cockpit. I think you can put two, maybe one minifigure, two maybe if you really try. Probably one though. It looks good. I mean, this front part's a little bit eh, but uh, I mean, what do you expect? Now this part, that's pretty bad. I, I, I feel like I understand why but I would definitely not display it like this. Uh, you can see there's tiles, so it slides out. It looks good. That part looks good. This part doesn't look good. And together they both look good. So this is them separate and this is them both back together. And that's it with them. The wings or whatever folded in. So this set can allegedly go over terrain because of the treads. I I haven't tested that because I don't really have like a carpet. Here's the interior. Pretty good. I like the top part more. I like the stickers. I'm pretty sure the other like the previous owner I bought this used also in a in a haul might have put the stickers on wrong. I don't know. I'm not really bothered by that. Mm, the treads, these are pretty cool. Uh, you know, obviously, like I said, it's missing that part, but I do have it. It's also used from a spinner crown. That, so yeah, that's um, this set, and uh, I'll show you all of my sets that are on the floor. Um, that's like all the uh, ninja vehicles and that's all the serpentine villains I want to keep collecting season one sets I think they're uh, they're definitely one of the greater greatest um, villain sets like Ninjago just doesn't do villains as much anymore so that's kind of unfortunate here's them all put back on the shelf uh, in order to make those two fit I have to like put the tail behind the shelf and down here at the bottom is the one that's incomplete. These sets are complete and my favorite. And like I said at the start, now I'll show you my minifigures. In the last video, I went on, I did a uh, stand tour. So I don't really feel like taking this out again, but here's all my ZX suits. As you can see, they have all their golden weapons. I also have um, two in here. And here's my uh, Serpentine Generals, uh, sorry for the sound. Um, I have Pythor, obviously, 
and two of the um, Fang Toms. Pretty sure that's his name, Fang Tom. Anyways, I have two of them and one Pythor. I have a Legacy Pythor, but I'm not counting him in this video. Here's a mock I made. Um, I will do a video on this someday. I don't know when, but it's the part where Pythor unites the four tribes. Here's all my Serpentine minifigures. I just took out Lasha because that's a Legacy one. But this one here is Lasha, which came in the Blade Cycle. Spitta. Um, I don't know that guy, honestly. Mm, don't know him. Fang Dam, I think, who came in the Fang Power Truck. Same as this one. Fang Tom, and my other Fang Tom is there. Uh, this guy. Uh, I don't. I don't remember what set he came in. I'm pretty sure these two came in the Electro Jet. I don't know what set that guy came in. But yeah, like I said, I'll do a video on this mock sometime. I don't know when, but I'll go over more detail on it. And yeah, those are my minifigures. Uh, nothing crazy. Obviously, I don't have a million dollars to army build. And as a bonus, I made this. These are all official parts. Um, these are all the four staffs. Except for Pythor, they didn't really make his in LEGO, so I just had to improvise. Mm, yeah, it's pretty go pretty cool. I don't know how I got so many of these staffs. I mean, two came in the Fang Power Truck, one came in the Rattlecopter, and I think, yeah, two came in the Electro Jet. I have two of them, so I got two. That's a spare. And I have some spinners. That's my... NRGJ spinner, which I just put the um, NRGJ from season 5, because why not? I think that's Energy Zane spinner, even though I don't have the figure and I never had the figure. And these are just some basic spinners. But yeah, so that's basically all my season 1 sets. If you enjoyed that video, please uh, like and subscribe, and I'll uh, see you in the next video. Goodbye.